and welcome back to the spooky stream. My name, as always, is Mr. Highland Guthrie, and I am here tonight with my love, Mrs. Joe Guthrie. How are you tonight, my love? I'm pretty good. How are you? I'm pretty great. It's Saturday, a.k.a. Friday. <laughs> um, You're welcome for the confusion. And we're really pumped. It's another spooky stream, and tonight... My fair weather friends. I guess that's kind of demeaning, actually. Yeah, that's not very nice. My not fair weather friends. Your my all forever best. My stormy weather friends. <laughs> tonight, we got some real spooks. We got some actual spooky games tonight. Is that a guarantee? Yeah, you know, Dredge has dredged its last dredge. Mm -hmm. It's funny because I even tried playing it the other day without the stream, and you know, it's it's a good game i don't think it's a bad game i don't know how much of it is is like for me beyond the first 10 hours and you know i was thinking about this today too uh there's so many games that like are just 10 out of 10 in the first few hours and don't really have anything beyond that and then there's games that are the complete opposite and the first one that comes to mind is like Doom, you know, isn't particularly, and I'm talking about like 1994 Doom, isn't particularly gripping um, past the, you know, or in the first hour, but it's so solid that the gameplay is just timeless. Versus, and this isn't an old versus new, but there's a new game out called Pacific Drive that I was talking about on the Discord, which I absolutely adored. You finished it, right? No, I just got bored. Mm. I got, I adored for the first. 10 15 hours adored then bored and then bored and mm -hmm. i was just like oh, that's what i gotta still do like no thank you and i find you know it's tough to make a game that's that's solid all the way through regardless i think dredge is probably solid all the way through just not really my cup of tea and we are done with it so get out of here uh dredge you are gone we did three solid streams three solid what streams streams, streams. get out of here there's a big one. There's my sound effects. Very good, very good. Very good. Uh, but we're back with Spooky Streams. If, if this is your first Spooky Stream, uh, welcome. Come over here on the jouch. That's a jean-covered couch. Yeah, grab a waffle. Get under the janklet. That's a jean-covered blanket. And uh, enjoy... <laughs> Enjoy the... rubbing elbows with everyone else. Yeah, rubbing alcohol with everyone else. What? Hand the bottle here. Uh, oh no. Yeah, it's spooky stream time. Uh, we talk in the Discord, and I look a little bit on the YouTube. I think some clever people have noticed that I respond more to the YouTube just because it goes less fast. There's so few of There's you. So if few you are people. watching on YouTube, welcome. Like the video. Oh yeah, like the video. That do it. Probably helps something. Uh, but yeah, got some fun games tonight. The community helped me out. Appreciate it so much. And uh, yeah, let's just get right into it. Because we've got a few short it. ones today. Oh, you know what I want to do up between. top? Do I want to say thank you to Dippity. Yeah? Dippity sent us probably the most beautiful dice I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh my God, yeah. They're absolutely um, Bespoke dice sets for each member of Dice Shame. Uh Nersals and Robs are still inbound, but we've got three of the set. We ate Nersals by accident. Yeah. Hey, Yammy. Hey, Thwip. Um, so thank you, Dippity. Thank You're you, You're so generous. You're amazing. Mm -hmm. I think we both thank them privately, so. Yeah. We got all of our nice bases covered. Tonight we get to be mean. Mean to the games we're about to play. Which is <laughs> funny because people were recommending a bunch. And some we had already played. And, uh, and some, only one... I was like, that's not our cup of tea. and, and Or my cup of tea, I should say. And speaking of, I have a cup of tea. But I say this because when we don't like something, and by we, I use the royal we, mm -hmm. we mm -hmm. tear it apart. So I don't want to play something that you are like in love with that I know I'm not going to like because then you're just going to be upset with me. And I'm okay with that, but it's just not fair to you. So let's just not do it. Everyone I do see them more. Hey, classically lonely. Everybody wants me to show the dice. There's like a clamor. Show the dice. Should I get up and take no. a picture? The, the lights are off. It's so stuff. far we'll away. It it's okay. I'll They're post it later. You know what? Dippity, just send the 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 uh, ad page of them. Oh, hey, Jamie. I don't ever read the Twitch chat because <laughs> who reads Twitch? Harlan 
ignores you specifically and was like, if I pretend that just I'm not reading <laughs> Twitch, then... No, never. I'm uh, but anyway, let's get into I'm it. joking. Let's dive into the deep end, as they say. Uh, depend? Depends. Dive into the depends. Uh, and uh, we're starting off with a, a hot one. Hot is in... Spicy? Spicy. Uh, hot is in... Topical. Hot as in it has no Hot as in mouse. it does not work. Do I not use the mouse? Maybe I don't use the mouse. I do want to turn it down. Oh, that's very... Let's just do that. Doesn't seem to be doing anything. Oh, a little bit, hey? Let's just do that. That's much better now. I might need to play with the settings real quick because this doesn't seem like normal. Um, so while Harlan is messing with the settings, I want to say hello, hello, hello to Fjord, Himmy, Deathno, Yammy, Marimo, KM, Retro, AK Trash Panda, Jasper, hello, hello. Thank you for joining us, everybody. Hi, Liz. Hi, Scotty. Hello, Scotty. Hello, Scotty. Hi, Stuff and Such. Hi, Peppers. You have my undivided attention. There we go. Hi, okay. Seer of Time. Hi, Faye. That was very confusing. You've done it, though. I'm very I proud did of it. you. Who's done it? Who's <laughs> done it? <laughs> okay. So, Buckshot Roulette, this has been a little hot, little hot, 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 hot shot, hot to trot. It's been hot to trot. I know it's very short. I know it's waffles are. Are not the best food, but very Dow Pal Mephisto, very, very sweet, Stephanie so. C. Barry Jeanette says that they have not been to to a spooky stream in quite some time. A so. noonday demon says, "Not gonna lie, I loved you guys ripping into Little Hope." So good. There you go. <laughs> You're welcome. Faye's gonna watch YouTube more. It sounds good. Perfect. All so hi Jeanette C. All right, let's do this. Backshot Roulette, a computer game by Mike was asking. Bring it. From the trailer it mm -hmm. looked a lot like remember that card game that we played during Ooh, Extra Life? yeah what was that called again inktober i don't remember no something like that that was a good game though i had a lot oh, of fun shoot. watching you play it oh let's party yo 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 Nice. I'm having a small private rave. I thought you were a seizure. Also that. <gasps> Please sign the waiver. Okay. See, doesn't it remind you a little bit of that game? <laughs> KM says played as raves. Nice. That's good. Um, it does remind me of that game. And God, I really... Yep, that's the only right <laughs> answer. I'm gonna die. I might as well die hilariously. I really hope. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> One live round, two blank. Cool. You can't really shoot yourself with a shotgun, though, right? Like, I mean, it, the barrel is too long. Uh, let's go deal it first, obviously. Hey, well done, babe. Well, oh, okay, I see. I mean, one in six, the odds. One in three. I thought, wait, why is he doing it to himself again? Oh, well, there you go. Now I, now I die. What? Well, that doesn't make sense. I thought you said there was one blank. Oh, two blanks. Now this changed. Oh, I see. Three live, two blanks. They enter the chamber in a hidden sequence. He's got so many teeth. I mean. I want to shoot this guy. <laughs> nice. Without anybody. Boobs win. <laughs> Boobs for the win. Mm hmm. <laughs> Boobs win. Boobs wins. <laughs> I, should, I should just wrote boob. Mm hmm. Okay, how are we going to make this more interesting? So far, I've just got to shoot you twice. <laughs> Two items. Okay. More items before every load. Cigarettes? I don't... Okay. 
two items each. And a knife. Okay. And he's got double cigarettes. One live, one blank. Fitty, fitty shot. Okay, but what's this? Shotgun deals two damage. Nice. Takes the edge off for gain one charge. Okay. Um, I feel like it's going to be a blank this time, so I don't want to use the double damage because I'm going to take this one in the face. Oh. Oopsies. Okay, but I can take my health back, so I'll do that. Well, that isn't he good if it's 50 50. Yes, it's I safe. think you run through all of the shots. Hmm. What's this? We're going to find out. So spooky. Hey, God played this. I know him. Okay, 2-2. Two, two. I always get to go first. Okay, let me, let's use this. Take the hit, take the edge off. And then, I mean, the odds are now it's got to be blank. Because so far the first one hasn't been blank in the last four rounds. That's not how... No, I know, but like... There we go. Now eat it. Check the current round in the chamber. That's cool. Dealer skips the next turn. Okay. So now we get to shoot again, right? Well, he's dead now. Boom. You should have doubled it up. Because now it's back to 50-50. Yeah, that's true. Ooh. Oh, he healed. Why do cigarettes uh -oh. give you health? Uh, Dang it. Dag nabbit. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Double damage. Dodged. I yeah, dodged we it. dodged it, no, though. No, I dodged it. I forget what the um, handcuffs did. It makes it so that we couldn't... Skip. Yes. <gasps> Sody pop. A little brewski. Might as well take a smoke, eh? Brewski does. Racks the shotgun, ejects current shell. Okay. Let's take the charge off. Or take a charge back, because we still get to do what we gotta do. Yep. Today I learned a sawed-off shotgun is literal. Oh, yeah. See, this speaks to people who haven't seen Evil Dead 2. Which I'm excited. Maybe we should just watch all of them. Um, yeah? One after the other? Yeah. So, let's do this, right? Yeah. I didn't... What was... How do you read that? I don't know. It looked like it was black. So I'll, It did look blue. Or blue. Excellent. Now we saw it. And now we'll use double damage. Yeah. The odds of it being... Let me shoot him. Nice. So he's down to two now. Perfect. It's all math. <laughs> odds are just totally <laughs> not just luck. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Stop smoking. It's bad for you. And your teeth it's bad for us. Yellow. All right, we're fitty fitty now. Oh, he's smoking again. Oh, he's gonna he's handcuff us. Full. Yeah. Uh oh. I keep forgetting what those do. Oh. <laughs> he did me the favor. Now I don't think we get to go. Now he goes it goes again, right? Yeah. Oh, that's what it means by skipping. Mm hmm. <laughs> 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 this kid just wants to commit suicide yeah. in front of us. <laughs> He's just like, I just want someone hey, to watch me. Hey, you stay there. Now it's our turn. Uh, I forget what the shells were. Dealer skips the next turn. <laughs> so there's two shots, and I had a blank, right? I think it was four and two. I think it was six, I believe. I, I wasn't... Watching, I think it was six. That means there's two shots left and one blank. Right? So if I... 
handcuff him and then shotgun a beer and it comes out then it's still a 50 50 shot but if the blank comes out then we know it's two know, right ah fuck it let's do it handcuff him I, th I think that's what makes sense let's eject this and hope that it's a black shell it was so now we know the next shot is uh potent right i believe so oh oh no, it's no that was the last shot whatever we're not good at this game okay but it's three and three Fifty fifty again. Uh let's go with him. Mm, he's got a sawed off. Nice. Die dealer. Ugh. Always yeah. with the smoking this guy. Always with the smoking this guy. Inscription, that's the game. Yes. That reminds me of. Well, I'm fine with this. The odds are pretty good for us. Yeah. <gasps> I was going to say, because it's it was 50-50, and then we shot one. This could go either way. So let's take this. Mm -hmm. let's and then just, we shoot. Let's just... Uh, hmm. It was blank for me. No, it was active for him, and then it was blank. Yeah. So it's 50-50 again. Yeah, it's 50-50. There's two and two. But I... I feel like it's blank. <laughs> and I felt wrong. Whatever. Yes. Suck it. And then it's a blank. That's right. So do they just skip this? Or does he fire on it? He's going to fire. I guess he'll do himself. Yeah. Excellent. Okay. All right. Last round, right? We yeah. can kill him here. Oh, definitely. Hopefully we get to go first. We always do. Then. Five Then this will be easy because we'll blank. do. We'll handcuff him and then we'll fire twice. Yeah. But no matter what happens, the, I mean, unless both are blanks, which would be pretty rare. We can smoke if we feel like it. Loser. Good night. Yeah, I agree. Stefan Such says, this is spooky, but not scary. And Mephisto says, this is more unsettling than anything. This I do get the warm -up. unsettling vibe. I didn't I didn't think this was going to be more than like 20 minutes. So I was like, mm -hmm. let's do this. No more defibrillators. <laughs> oh, wait, I guess we did have defib. What's this now? I don't know what we're looking at. Oh, it's like one and done. Yes. Oh, but there's still charges. Oh my gosh, that's too many. I mean, got good odds here. Excellent. Suck it. Of course, he has like two handcuff handcuffs and two. Yeah. You know. Oh, that's good. Okay, better start using some of these. We got four each round, right? Yes, and okay. so that there's so four and four right now, so it's 50-50. him. Because this is the easiest way to do this. And then check what's coming up next. That's black. Yeah, so it's a blank. Yeah, so we'll use it on us. Then, if we shoot him, yeah. then it's going to be our turn again. Exactly, and then we'll handcuff him again. Oh fuck! What are the odds? 
Well, someone does. He them. breaks <laughs> out. <laughs> oh, I can't do it again. Okay, well, whatever. Let's just shoot. Oh, he didn't break out. Interesting. I wonder why he didn't break I've, out. I now he's gonna break out. Okay. There we go. Well, let's handcuff him again. Oh no, it goes straight to it. I see. I see. Mm. Okay. This game was more distressing than I was expecting for the stream. Yeah, it's kind of weird, eh? I hope everyone's okay. It's pretty violent, but you know what? This is what spooky streams are all about. Ah, uh, they got us. Don't worry, we can smoke as many cigarettes as we feel like. I don't know if you guys knew this, but heal, heal yourself with smoking cigarettes. Easiest way to do it. Oh, I guess, yeah, now he gets to go again. Oh, bummer. Oh, he took out the fucking, whatchamacallit. I think you rigged this. He is a computer. Oh, loser. Sucker. Ops, you died. Let's yeah, smoke, smoke him if you got him, right? Yeah. I mean, he's not healing, at least. And then we should look? Yes. I'm thinking... I'm thinking handcuff him. Oh, I wasn't counting the shots. How many are left? I don't remember. That's active. So let's... Take him down a notch. Good night, sweet prince. More like poop. <laughs> sweet poop. Oh, it's true. Marie never gets fed, by the That's way. That's right. I'll check again, right? At yeah, point, I think if we had been items. counting. There we go. Now he's on the last two. I don't know what that is, but. He's okay. upset about it. Now he goes, right? Are, are you, you ready? ready? No, none of us are ready. It's just you, bro. Oh, I guess it's just another thing for us to keep track of, right? <laughs> just lots of blades there. Mm -hmm. Three, two. Okay, so it's five total. Why not? Yeah, because he's got two health. I don't I don't even see him have any health, but man. Nice. Suck on that. He's gotta be dead, right? Yeah. yeah. I thought we were playing for keeps. I mean, lives. I mean, nine million dollars. Nine million. Well, that's only. I mean, I don't even know how much that could be. Fifties. <laughs> yeah, we have started feeding Marie finally. We I actually. actually took her to the I was night. gonna. <laughs> Congratulations, peeps. Yeah, we took her to the uh, buffet, and she was really into mango pudding. Cool. See, that's what that was like. What? Not even 20 minutes, 15 minutes. It was like minutes. 45 seconds. Double or nothing or locked. Cool. Now let's try something spooky. Thank you so much for pulling that, Dippity, because I was really hoping <laughs> someone would screen cap Congratulations, it. Congratulations, <laughs> Cool. Money to buy lives. All right. So that was shotgun roulette or whatever. Buckshot I also roulette. got a little bit distracted by gameplay and forgot about chat, but I'm back. Guess who's back? Back again. Joe is back. Also, I have heartburn. Heartburn's hair. Why? What was that word? I don't know. So this is a game called Exudate. I think because we ate so much chicken, chicken parmesan. Parmigiano. Mm hmm Ding. Hello, Jonathan. 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 Yes, yes, yes. Left, oh, yes. Left, keep left. Uh, ah, there. Wait a minute. Hold on. Jonathan? Good day, Jonathan. Jonathan. Well, what if we f chase him down the hallway? Not Wait. yet. I'm sure that was just a misunderstanding. I mm -hmm. must be 
I must be sleepy. Sleepy. Chicken marmesan. That's right. Oh. Jonathan. Jom. Sir. Wait, turn around and then look what back. If I don't let him keep left. There must be a reason behind this nonsense. <gasps> All right, let's look. Eight, eight, open. Ah, uh, yes, with a smile. Eight, eight. Two. Rebecca says this is like that one scene from American Werewolf in London. Oh yeah, or that scene from Possession. Jonathan. Wait, what? Is that the movie Possession? Definitely from American World. Security camera in operation. Where? Security is in the corners. They'll be able to tell us what's going on with Jonathan. Make it so. All right, all right. Yeah, see, look, there's security cameras. No smoking. He left. All right, let's try the most obvious thing, right? Oh, that says one now. That's good. We were at, oh, and it flicked on, right? Something changed. Manor Pants says, so I legit have nightmares about running through places like this and being chased by something. I never know what it is, but I know I have to keep moving. Maybe I'll skip sleep tonight. Oh, now it says zero again. Okay, so oh, we look, didn't do it right. Don't overlook any anomalies. If you find anomalies, turn back. If you don't find anomalies, do not turn back. Go out from exit eight. Okay. So this is like observation duty. Kind of. I saw eight to eight. I looked at these. I tried to push him. That sound again. Oh, look, that light. He's holding a phone and he's got his little handsome briefcase. That light is on. <laughs> Move fest. I think this is good. This is the right one. Let's continue. I feel good. About this number? Yeah. Oh, zero again. <laughs> I don't think it counts if we go back now. Let's just go back in general. Oh. Jonathan? Jonathan? Sir? S Hello? I love the sound of our little shoesies. Yeah, it's pretty so nice. Cute. What did we do? There's that click again. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. Let's look at all the signs. The so lights we got... also seem Ooh, odd. Oh, wait. That light is weird. That's what I was saying. The lights seem odd. Yeah, so turn back. Ah, one. Yes, good. So you turn back when there's an anomaly. Yes. I see. Okay. So let's take a look for anomalies. So the time I went forward and it said one, there was were no anomalies. Was because there were no anomalies. Look. Look at this. That Who's guy better? didn't have a beard last time. He's not wearing a beard. He's got like a little mustache. That's not a beard. That's at most a board. My mistake. It's okay. I wonder how small the anomalies are. Ah, that light is not on. Do so, we go back? What? Should it be on? Well, it was previous. Yeah. All I'm all I mean to say is I don't know what the standard is, but that light's not on. Left. Two. Okay. <gasps> Good. Smoking. I feel like these are going to be tricky too. Remembering which of those are checked off. Mm. 
All right, does he got his little mustache? Does he have his little phone? He's not wearing socks. He's got that sexy look. I don't know how much of this is going to change. I was not looking at the dog salon or like any of this art, really. Hmm. Her eye is a different color there. Yeah, that's not right. Right? That, that to me is enough to say anomaly. I think that's weird. Let's go back. Let's keep that in mind. Oh, Cam says I think they're more obvious signs. Hmm. This one makes you motion sick. You know why? It's because there's no <coughs> FOB. Me. Oh, wait a minute. Is there an FOB? <gasps> we love a fob in this house there now you're gonna feel much better there because the thing is when the fov is really tight turning makes you feel really sick and i don't blame you i'm the same way ah turn back turn back turn back that's an anomaly see watch so i bet slowly you will not feel as sick anymore three, three. i'm so proud of you and no i know that sounds dumb but no proud of us i do have to go get a gaviscon or something though oh i'm so sorry no it's all right on my desk no we're not that old yet i mean we are but we're super old we're like very old yeah he's still his handsome self concourse this looks probably normal dewey dog oh. ah that's not right Oh my god. Leave me alone. <sighs> that was kind of scary. That was fun. I'm not going to lie. I like this That game. freaked me out a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, 30 is very old. Yeah. Totally. That's how old we are. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm turning 30 next year. <laughs> god, to be 29 again. Yeah. Oh, come on. You're still young. I had such a nice bod at 29. Shut up. You still have such a nice bod. <laughs> okay, people. Anomalies. Cam says, I've been turning 30 for a while. Yeah, same. Looks good. Has everyone had a sip of tea? Mm, don't drinking? forget. Don't forget your tea, guys. There's nothing worse than making a nice cup of tea and then just forgetting it. I guess she does have a brown eye, hey? She sure does. No red light. Do we think it's good? Should this we go? Seems good. I don't know. Let's take a look at this little sign. No, no smoking. smoking. Seems pretty normal. Left. Five. We're on. Oh, no. It was a joke. Everyone's actually older than me right now. Yeah. AK Trash Panda turns 35 in nine days. Whoa. Birthday time. Happy birthday. What's up? Fiora says, I am way under the age range here. You know what? We have a lot of different aged people here. Yeah, there's no right or wrong. To answer. be clear, this stream is supposed to be 18 plus. Yes. Don't tell us if you're not 18 yet. That will make us feel weird. No, Just I mean, pretend. whatever do you do. But the, the important thing is we <laughs> say no, no words. We like do say no, no words. Pee pee and poo poo and stuff mm -hmm, like that. Mm hmm. Mm. Ooh, Marshall's oh. drinking t red velvet chocolate tea. That sounds yummy. Sounds delish. I love me some red velvet. Problem is, red velvet needs like cheesecake frosting. Yeah. So how does that work in a tea? You just gotta put a little bit of buttermilk in there. Just a little cheese. Just a little splash of chi chi. Um, Marimo turns 35 in 14 days. Hey, happy birthday, Marimo. What do you got planned? Yeah, what's your plan? Where at? are we all meeting up? Oh, I should check this guy. Also, I want to know, what is your favorite kind of cake? Or are you a pie person? Do you cake? Do you pie? Good pie. Good pie. <laughs> hmm. Lou is drinking their 10th cup of coffee and I'm... Oh, Lou, that's so much coffee. All about it. 
I do that. Fun fact, red velvet is chocolate, but with red dye. Yeah. There's actually a really fascinating episode of Good Eats, one of my favorite shows about red velvet cake. I highly recommend everyone watch that. They also talk about devil's food cake in that, which is just the best named cake. (laughs) It is. What kind of food is devil's food, do you think? Probably like... Cheese fondue. I feel like this is probably safe. Let's move up. Um, Mephisto says, I'm ah, gonna... oh, we messed it. Fuck. What you can't it? go back. Mephisto says, I'm drinking a tea called Prince Vladimir. Well, hello. Prince it's very tra la la of you. Ooh, Marimo says, lol, I'm getting some Korean barbecue with a few friends and then with my fam because we're going to an apple orchard because I'm excited like that. That sounds adorable. That sounds really nice. All right. Rebecca says, did you guys know German chocolate isn't actually German? It's named after a guy named German. Yeah, it's American, isn't it? Hello, my name is German chocolate <laughs> my, cake. My name is German. Oh, look German. at that weird fucking body. Yeah, I don't. Oh, oh, oh Jesus. That's run, spooky. run, 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 run. That's very scary. Eek. Ah. Oh, Jesus. He's still coming. Uh, eek. Uh. Don't let him catch us. Thank you. All right, this game is weird. I like it, though. So what did we miss, though? So, so far I've seen a doorknob in the center Mm -hmm. of the door. Yes. We saw some wonky lights. Oh, wicky wonky. We saw writing that said, turn back, turn back, turn back, turn back. So they were pretty obvious. But the the other one I was looking, I didn't see fucking nothing. Okay, this is 1219 Tuesday. Let's keep that in mind. I feel like they must get harder... The, the higher, higher up you get, because this I would argue, I would say this one is clean. Yeah. The tiles don't switch till here, right? Let's see. Okay, that that was a clean one. It's Korean barbecue, eh? That sounds fun. Yeah. We want to come. Invite can I, us. Can I come? <laughs> can we be those people? Oh, we're just here. Stuff and such says there's a panel on the ceiling. Yeah, that one. This gentleman is trying to seduce me. And he's succeeding. He has succeeded. I mean, succeeding. Yeah, there's a panel in the ceiling there. I mean, I don't see anything else glaring. Two two black vents on the right. Mm -hmm. How many panels in the ceiling? Three panels on the ceiling. One there, one there. Three security cameras. No smoking signs. Two smoke. No smoking signs. I like that chat is evenly divided between talking about cake and hormone replacement therapy. <laughs> They're related things. Well, as f- in terms of like the things that people are doing to celebrate birthdays. Okay. Yeah. Take a sip. Oh no, Marie's awake. Oh. Maybe she's just pranking me. me. Pranking you? Yeah, maybe she's pranking me. You fell for it, mother. I think she she did. She just closed her eyes and went back to sleep. (laughs) She just wanted to make Uh, sure. Ah, prank. Okay. Anomalies. Anomalies. Moon says, hello. I don't know what's going on, but there's three panels on the ceiling. Thanks for your assistance, Moon. We're... Cake. By ah, the ocean. What? Never mind. <laughs> what is it? I only saw one of the black um, vents, and I was like, "Ah, look, there's a mi- oh, never oh mind. nope, no." How embarrassing nope. for him! Wait, go back to the right side. Oh, okay, never mind. I thought that whole panel with the red light was missing, but then I saw it. Yeah, you pulled a me. Yep, you did it, and then I did it. Barry Jeanette is turning 32 next week. Oh, happy wow. birthday. Wow, so many birthdays. I'm loving happy it. Birthday what do you think, safe? Safety? Yeah, let's do it. It's only safe if we run. 
This should be four if we're right. No! What did we miss? <sighs> That's not fair. Undo, undo. All right, whatever. I feel like I just want to run through until we get to one. That we're start. like, ooh. Nope. Hi, Jonathan. The guy's just going to reach out and try to stab us one time, I bet. Nope. Seriously? It's like buckshot roulette. Should we keep going or turn around? There we go. I like that you just kind of wanted to peek. <laughs> Who wanted to peek? You You peeked at the number. You were like, mm, let me just peek. Oh, did I? Yeah. Yeah. So what? So there, there must be subtler ones because we're we're not. Oh, oh, there we oh, go. go back. I just saw one. Maybe this is part of it too. No. N M Y N H. Let's keep that in our little. Document. I won't. I can't. And I won't. And I can't. I can't explain why, but this one feels anomalous. Yeah? Yeah. Getting some anomalous readings on this. Some weird vibity vibes. Please. One day I will hope he just walks by with just undies. He's just naked. <laughs> Hi. Yeah, one time it was just a red light. It was on a the red camera, light, yeah. So. Oh, does that look weird to you? I don't know. I've never really looked at this. Hmm. Hmm. I also think some of them might take a second to kick in. Like the rushing blood water, for example. <laughs> I think that was proximity generated. You think? Yeah. Is the chat helping at all? No, chat is talking about uh, birthdays still. Oh, I want to hear more. Um, okay. I'm going to scroll up a little bit. So what do we think? Like, this is probably... Liz's sister's birthday is next week as well. Happy birthday, Liz's sister. Moon is really into the tapping sound of people walking yeah, in the game. That's fine. All right, should we do this? I don't know. Actually, Stuff and Such oh, was helping and said, I think the eight sign is upside down there. It was not. Uh, so many April birthdays. But it might have been on the other one. Ooh, Faye said six. The musical I listened for the first time this year, and I'm obsessed with it. Six. The I musical? think Harlan's mom just saw that today. Never heard of it. She was talking about it yesterday. She was. Yeah. I know she said she was going to see something with the Grandma musical, Ma, and it yeah. was only about eighty minutes. Yeah. She said it was called Six. Yeah, it's about Henry the Eighth's wife. Oh, that's right. Well, the, I think because you knew what it was, mm, it she stuck said in my this, little and brain. you kind of jumped on it and filled her auto, and I was like, I don't. Is I did. That, I auto filled her. No, no, not in a bad way. I just didn't. Re I didn't understand what it was. Is it any good? Uh face said that they're obsessed. So. Ooh. Historical musicals, very in right now. Very in. He says, as if Hamilton was. Queen said six game. is so 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 good. And Retro said six. The musical was very fun. I've never even heard of it. It was yesterday. Abriel's partner's birthday last week Aww. and her nephew's and the niece's birthday earlier this week. Yeah, you went. Did you go camping, Abriel? I think I remember seeing a photo or something in the chat. Yes. Good. Okay. You're doing great. Thank you. We're all helping. I do you. like games that are like observant thoughtful and well yeah i mean definitely this vibe i'm into but i also appreciate the reward of like so few games reward you as a person um without uh, some extreme skills you know what i mean like mm -hmm. if you play elden ring you got to be really really good to be good at that game and then you get a reward but games like this they reward like it's less about skill was that QR code always there? It's less about skill. I mean, somewhat skill, but more just about like 
something that you don't need hours and hours of practice to have. Yeah, you just, just be patient. Watch, which I really like. Just look good. Were these always this close together? Yeah. Probably. Blaze three sixty five K says, "I want y'all to play Rotten Flesh." Whoa, that it's a hot. sound proximity game. Very interesting. Oh yeah, lots of people are talking about the eclipse. That was this Monday. The eyes moving. What? No. Both people said eyes moving. What? Oh, those eyes? Ah. Yes. Go back. Go back. Whoa. Good job. Good eye. Wow. Peppers, stuff and such. Rebecca, all Good doing eye, eyes. Jay. Great job. Thank you for the ping. Right, bloody job, See, man. when we do these kinds of games also, you can't... Chat. <laughs> no. Well, because I look, I look over at chat. That's probably why I missed those eyes. What I mean to say is you can't spoil it for us by helping. You know no, what I mean? No, it's not spoiling it's it. It's working as a team. Yeah. You got a good eye there. Eh? Did a good eye. Yeah. Um, so yeah, happy Friday night. What's everyone doing for this weekend? Is everyone coming to the Korean barbecue at Marimont's? Yeah, let's all go. Not that that's this weekend. Right? Marimont's birthday's next week? Yeah. But, you know, what are we all doing? These freaky little eyes. They're kind of freaky, hey? Freaky little eyes. All right. We're going to um, have some friends over tomorrow. We're really excited about it. That's right. Tomorrow night. Yep. Going to have some burgers. Mm -hmm. Going to have some friends over. Mm -hmm. Going to make some French fries. Ooh, Queen's going to a Ren fair tomorrow. <laughs> so you're going to say rave. Uh, yeah. Like, nice. I've never been to a Ren fair. I kind of want to. I do too. I'm jealous. I'm 50% jelly. Should we go, I think? Yeah. Wait a minute. What? Wait a tick. Is that right? I is think that... that click is when it clicks right, over. Let's just do it. Right. Yay! Let's make it an easy one. Let's do this. Ooh, Moon is cleaning their new house and <gasps> doing volunteer stuff. Oh. I'm so jealous. That's so nice. So nice. Who wants I to help Moon? Want a clean? new house? Let's get a new house. Yes, please. Let's get a house. Uh, Let's... Lambda is running two D and D games this weekend. Whoa, oh Lambda! Stress, stress. Same, same campaign or save some D and D for the rest of yeah, us? Yeah, don't, don't. Wow, you're hogging hog it, it all. all. <laughs> you're being a D and D hog. Hog and dos. <laughs> hog and dos D and D. Is it the same like? Um, campaign and you're running two sessions or is it two separate games? That's a any, great question. They said they just have to do a lot of prep. Yeah. Or do very little prep and just let it be one of those games. Yeah. Faye said, I have two shows this weekend. I'm playing Greta in Murder on the Orient Express. Oh, I've never very cool. been able to make it through that movie. But I really want to. And I love Murder Mysteries. And I'm sure you're going to do amazing. I think I watched the Anthony Perkins, Albert Finney, 1970 version. Mm. Oh, no. Excuse me, but I can't remember it for the life of me. And then I tried watching the remake and it was pretty... Moon awful. said, please help me clean. The old owner was a smoker. Oh, no. I'm so sorry. That sucks. All right. Should we push this through? Push through. Everyone's got to be on board for this. I'm always on team push through, and it's often wrong. I don't see anything. Yeah. Okay, wait. The light just flick. No. I don't think you're ready for this jelly. Jabu, 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 jelly. Come on. What's your favorite flavor of jelly? I know that it's Seven. strawberry. Ah, yes. <laughs> um... What's your favorite flavor? I know it's strawberry. That's what you just said. <laughs> yeah. What's your favorite flavor? I know it's strawberry. We're married. Yeah, probably strawberry. Or raspberry. I'm a red berry boy. Yeah, you are. Hi. 
I'm a red berry boy. Berry boy. Oh, there's no... S Wait, is that a skull on the ceiling? It looks like something, right? That's a little face. Guys, tell us right now. That's a screaming face. That's never been there before. That's a scream face. I can tell. But that is that hasn't been there before, I don't no. think. No. We would have noticed. Should we go back? It's a screaming face. It's definitely something. Should we Ooh, go back? Roanoke. I'm with you. Raspberry jelly for the win. Well, that's what I said. Did I say raspberry? No, you said strawberry. But I said, didn't I also say I like raspberry? It should I think we just sang about jelly. Should we go back? I would say go back. No one is agreeing with us. They're just talking about jelly. <laughs> well, I prefer jam to jelly anyway. So Same. Whatever. If this resets it, I blame you. Like, yeah, I did just make a Larry Boy <gasps> reference. Hey. Uh, you caught me. Who made a reference? I can't talk about it. What'd you say? Nothing. What? I said Barry Boy. What's that? I I was very religious growing up. Yeah. There's a cartoon series called Veggie Tales. Oh yeah, you talked to me about this. Yeah, it's just that I sometimes it seeps out through the cracks. You said some of it was very funny. Yeah, I don't know if it, it qualifies as very funny. No, you said once that one was very funny or something. Yeah. Anyway. You know how there are sometimes things in your head that you wish that you could knock out of there and replace them with like good and useful things? Yeah. It's th that's one of them. Yeah. Stupid Veggie Tales. I love it. I love Veggie Tales. <laughs> when you were out today with Henry, <clears throat> yeah. Marie and I, after breakfast. Oh. Go back, I guess. Oh, eek. Ah, uh, this is spooky. I don't like this. I don't want to play anymore. Oh. oh, that scared me. That scared me too. When you were out with, uh, whew, when you were out with Henry, what? When I was out with Henry and you were there with Marie. What was the story with eight? I forget. Did we just go to the exit now? I think we're supposed to just go home. Can we go? Can we leave? Um. Yeah, I don't know. Should we go forward? I don't want to reset all of our progress. Yeah, everyone's all about... Veggie tails in the chat now. Oh my god! <laughs> <I'm> so sorry. <laughs> um, no, when you were out and Marie and I were home after breakfast, she was kind of looking sleepy. Yeah. I didn't want to put her down. I just want to cuddle with her on bed. Mm -hmm. So I put on a TV show. Yeah. And I put on all those dancing. No. Oh, fuck sakes. Well, I think we're done this game, right? Well, now I want to see. One more time. No, I put on something called Miss Rachel. Oh, yeah. So many of these, like, Discord yeah, moms talk about awful. Miss Rachel. I really disliked it. She was into it for a little bit, and then she kept looking at me. Like, oh, oh crap. Hi. Hi, buddy. Yeah. Um. Because you're my cheeseburger, my little cheeseburger. I'll wait for you. No, she didn't really sing songs. No, I just mean someone. Do you remember the cheeseburger song? And so I just started what? singing it from wait, Veggie you went Tales. From, I hate this to singing it. I know. Are you embarrassed by it or not? Everyone started talking about how much they remember it and love it, and I can't. I literally, I think I've seen a clip of it because I know it's like talking pickles and yeah. it's like reboot era graphics and shit. Yes. Yeah, no, I don't. I was not raised in a religious household whatsoever. Except the cringe, Joe. Yep. And that's the last time I'm going to do that. But you guys know it's hidden deep inside of me. Deep inside of me, there's a cringy veggie tale episode. Recap. Yeah. One last try. Preferably one gonna... where when we're on eight. You help me. Because <laughs> you're singing Veggie Tales. I'm trying my best. <laughs> we were like at the end. We were so close. You can't blame me. I won't. Thank you. On stream. Yeah. After stream, <laughs> you're going to be like. You burst me tonight. Oh, that's. Wow. Too, that's too, that's too um, real. Not mm -hmm. real for this family, but real for people. Sad Yeah, times. sad. That's the word. Yeah. Um, the screen just glitched. I don't know if it was the game. It's there for like a second. Did you see that? Yeah, I did. I think that was not the game. 
Do you think it's this? Yeah, I think it, we can go. Okay. Ah, I, I don't know what it was, but something happened, so we're good. Give me some of those obvious ones. You yeah, know? give me a blood wave. Give me a blood wave. Give me a running give me cube a man. <laughs> give me a wonky ceiling light. Give me a wonk. What's this? What? You getting texts? Oops. What? Uh, I wrote a reminder. Take Henry out of school, but I put it for 9 p.m. instead of 9 a.m. Excellent. Whoops. Your mom, when she was texting me, asked if it was okay if she could come over at 1 a.m. <laughs> I thought that nice. was really funny. <laughs> so it's a family thing. That's right. <laughs> it gets tough around noon, like, to remember. Oh, yeah. Like, I still have to pause um, when I'm talking about, like, noon to be, like, tw 12 p.m. That's you know why you I mean? always say 1201. That's why I always say 12. No, whenever you're like ah. making plans with someone and you're like, yeah, I'll meet you at 12. 12.01. 01 p.m. Just, just to do it. So that yeah, you know. Yeah, that's why I do it. Whoa. Buddy. Hey, bud. Buddy. Your face is all <laughs> fucked. You, gotta, you have got a little something on there. Yeah, people tried to ban Harry Potter. Oh, oh yes. That was a one. I, I thought it was a seven know. for a second. They should have. Just kidding. Oh, that's an anomaly. Kiwi's a dirty, dirty witch. Who? Kiwi. Ooh. Oh, bye, Yammy. Bye. Thanks for hanging out. You're going to miss the really gory stuff after this, I promise. Yeah, we're going to play a game where you get all up in someone's guts. You get all up. Well, that just sounds hot now. Yeah, it does sound. Well, not hot, but kind of like. Sexy. Like kind of goopy. Get you up know. all in the guts. You think that's hot? Oh, yeah. You never heard that? Of course I have, but I've always Get been like... them guts? That's one of those sayings that makes me kind of want to go like... Oh. Yeah, but I, I'm thinking of my, you know, rap career. Oh, oh, yes, yes, I'm yes. I'm thinking of, of a specific song. <laughs> of course. Be up in them guts like every day. I forgot about your rap career. <laughs> Good night, Melton Walrus. Good night, Thank Melton you for Walrus. hanging out with us. You have to go too. Oh no! Is time. This the game? Should we leave? should we stop the game? I think we might have to is stop killing, playing this game. Is it killing everybody? Oh wait, wait, wait! What? Where's the other trapdoor? Oh no, it's there. All right. I mean, it's just us walking down a hallway for. It's been pretty spooky. Fifty-five minutes, and it's zero. Okay, let's leave. I like that game though, personally. I'm glad. That was like observation. Forget duty, Peggy but Gordon. Butcher raps now. <laughs> that was like, that was like, what's the word? Oh, fuck. Fun? That was like observation duty, but I got to do more. Ah. Which I really like. Observation doing something. Observation actually fucking getting to play. Yeah. So this is a game recommended by, I think, Peppers. Thanks for the recommendation, so Peppers. So blame that. I mean, yeah. Thanks for the recommendation. We love that. There's a lot of chit chat up top in the chat. About? About what games you could play. This one's called Perfect Vermin. Ooh, terrible FOB. Whoa, are you being serious? Stuff and such? They said no other game had me so tuned in. What? I don't know if they're talking about Perfect Vermin or the last game. Oh, I hope so. Look, at the end of this, we'll go back to that for all the true... Oh, Seer of Time says, no, sorry, I sadly have some other errands to run. I love this Suki stream, no matter what y'all are playing. Suki. Suki now stream. I watch Golden Girls. I very much do have to take some pills now, though. I'll oh, be right shit. back. Yeah, yeah. That just hard crashed. Ow. Sorry. You bumped into me. Did I hurt you? No. Why did you say ow? <laughs> I like to be dramatic. <laughs> yeah, we played We Were Here. It was a blast and a half. Uh, I don't think so. No, thank you. No, I'm great. Thank you. All right, let's try this again. Perfect vermin. If it crashes. Oh. That was unexpected. Okay. Um, 
yeah, when it's when the stream is over, don't worry. Us diehard fans will finish from a Buick 8 or whatever that game was called. I have a sledgehammer for some reason. Love it. I'm quite enjoying it. I don't know what this game is. I don't know if Peppers has denied or agreed that they were the person who recommended this yet. Oh no. But it crashed again. It's the second time it crashed. Hmm. Hmm. Let's try full screen mode. Let's try one more time. Long Dark is a good game, but you know what? I must say, I don't like the person who made it. <laughs> Long story short, back when we used to stream a bunch of RPGs on Wednesdays, which we don't really do anymore because of babies and life. Um, I was really enjoying The Long Dark, and I kind of wrote a RPG inspired by it, and... What? Oh, oh. there was a five announced four. We ah. had to kill something. Oh, this is fun. I'm liking this. I was just smashed because I'm an ass. God damn it. Yeah, Peppers said... <sighs> crashed again um wait this might not yes i fun. recommended it and i did it on purpose to fuck up your stream get fucked <laughs> thanks peppers oh thank you oh wait because it crashes mm -hmm. oh you're being sarcastic yeah so what were you <laughs> saying about this rpg you wrote oh game crashing here we go every single time i play it crashes no i wish it would stop wait how do you play the game i have the same problem yeah the devs try to fix it, but it can't Hello, this game and the method I use my screen around the first time. Little turn off the Wi-Fi in the main menu. Okay. There's Wi-Fi. Wait, what? How the fuck? Turn off the Wi-Fi. Like menu? turn off our Wi-Fi. Well, that doesn't work when you stream. Yeah, I don't think we can do that. There is a way to block it. Oh, you know what's funny? I was playing another game. That kept crashing, and it, they told me to turn off the Wi-Fi. Uh, you add it to like the exception list, and it saved it. As Interesting. Well. One way to avoid the crash: just turn off Wi-Fi connection. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the way to do it. The problem is, yeah. So I did it. There was a way to add an exception to... I did it with another game. Let me see if I can remember real quick. You talk to the people. I absolutely will. Um, a lot of people in chat are sharing their troubled experiences with religion. Whoa. Um, and with their family's relationships pertaining to religion. I think just dovetailing off of my admission and brief discussion of veggie tales and i want you to know that you deserve better than that and you're not alone especially here um and if you have a great relationship with your chosen religion that's great too we don't bash that stuff i don't personally have a good relationship with religion because of my past um and harlan and i are both agnostic type atheists but um I want you to know that you are loved and cared about, even if you had to travel far away from your family or escape in other ways. Sorry to be really heavy. <laughs> uh, Blaze says my cat is screaming at me for not watching him instead of the stream. And that reminds me of Erica. Whenever we play games with Erica, Rocky, Erica's cat, is always viciously mauling her <laughs> pretty much every 10 minutes to get food um god you guys must really love cats to put up with that stuff because i can't imagine having a creature in my home that bites me <laughs> for food <laughs> the dogs are enough you know feeling the love in this chilies tonight yeah 
Peppers says, I see a lot of my family in Daniel Saltzman. Help me reapproach my mindset. LOL. Need more Erica streams. Yeah. Oh, yes. And Erica also screams all the time. Yeah, we love Erica. Uh, we played Erica. some all right, let's try this again. Helldivers with her recently, and that was a lot of fun. Lots yeah. of screaming still with her. All right, I've added it to an exception outbound rule. Hey, Brad Sample. Pretending that's your full name, Brad Sample. <gasps> Queen has pizza. On. Yeah, jealous. Marie just hasn't started biting yet, and that's where you would be wrong. Because she has two tiny baby bottom teeth. Yeah. And she's vicious with those things. It's amazing. So, were we talking about religion or something? Yeah, I think a lot of people were like talking about religion and uh, it's hard. It's hard for people. Religion is so baked into family and for a lot of folks, they have to get away. And then that means that you kind of have to get away from your family and it's complicated. Yeah. I think Avril Lavigne put it best when she said, ah, oh, god damn it. Can't she did it. say that. <laughs> she said, ah, oh, god damn it. Ah, oh, god damn it. All right, we're switching to something called Trap. Sorry, Peppers. Um, I think this is another one by maybe the person who did From a Buick Gate or whatever that one was called. Oh, my story. So The Long Dark. I really, I really liked it. Um, and I wrote a little RPG kind of inspired by it. And it used mechanics that I thought were really fun about like freezing temperatures and stuff. And like as we were promoting it, uh, as we were promoting <laughs> promoting it um the dude the, like the owner of the company who like fucking I guess made the game or whatever was like yeah can you not do this wow really and like was really sassy about it and I remember being like cause he, they're also Canadian you know and I was like oh okay and he's like yeah we may want to do something like this in the future and I don't appreciate using our like I didn't use their logo or anything I just called it the long dark the RPG Mm -hmm. And uh, he was real pissy about it. And I was like, okay. So I just fucking changed the name of it. And Did those it anyway. who watch the RPGs, uh, it's called The Longest Night or something like that. And he was equally sassy about it. And then afterwards, I did a little research into him, like his Reddit account and everything. He's he's such a fucking baby. He's, he's just one of those creators. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And you're like... Ugh, so not a big fan of the dude. Very, very shitty. Anyway, now we're playing Trapped. I have one other point-and-click adventure game that's a horror one, so hopefully this one sells the spooks because we promised spooks this week. This we week. did, we promised. And to be fair to the, that dude sort of sucks when people like steal your IP or whatever but I don't think he really reacted appropriately to no. the intent and additionally I wasn't like like if someone was like hey I want to make oh I want to make a malevolent RPG I would have been like oh no because I want to do that but that's not what I was pitching what I was saying is hey I'm running a RPG inspired and I explained it to him I was like no 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 this is like just one game that I that I wrote inspired by your product and as a uh counter when we ran the darkest dungeons rpg which was also and more directly inspired by a game they were like this is amazing and they retweeted it it's just about the person it's yeah not, it's not about the product some people don't get it and some people do get it and it was a very like childish response anyway Thanks to everybody who said that our baby's cute. That baby? <laughs> uh, go. She's pr she's pretty good. Man, I really wanted to try that Perfect Vermin game. Yeah, you can play it later when you can turn off the Wi-Fi, I guess. How? Oh, yeah, but I can't stream it. No. I wanted to stream it for Peppers. I know. Oh, no. Is this a hiding game? Oh, I just... I have a fear... I don't know, just you can block the door and oh, hide in the no. cabinet. No. Sounds like we're gonna not do that and die and I then play a different game. I really don't want to do that though. Shh. 
shit. Well, I only got one other scary game. What is it? It's a point and click adventure game. Oh no, I also have Fran Bow or something. Or Fran Bow or. Just give me a five paragraph essay on it. Blaze says, Have you ever played Shut In? I don't know. Let's see what kind of monster we're hiding from. Should we just go. Yeah, let's just go find him. Let's play. Hello? Find the monster, the game. Oh, I know this. <laughs> Roanoke. Try to be tired of being nice? Try acquiring teeth. Trademark. Now with mod modular installments, you can get two sets meant to last most of your lifetime. Most. Use the various models to bite, shred, grind, and pierce accordingly. Sink Whoa. those teeth trademark into whatever you choose, all for the low, low price of thirty nine ninety nine a month for 12 months, zero interest. It's a good ad. It's a great ad. I'd buy teeth. Let's buy some teeth from Roanoke. I'd buy teeth right now. Everyone, get in line. We're first. So those who are not familiar with spooky streams, which as I've been doing them for many years now, like years now, I do not like these types of games. Mm. Um, that What's are this like game's name? Trapped. Okay. It's like hide from the thing. Yeah. Um, Harlan likes, they're not bad. They're Harlan not likes bad. agency. I like he agency. likes to run fast. He likes to shoot. Yeah. Oh, something's coming, right? I thought so. I thought I heard double footsteps. That might have just been me. Unless he's in here. When you doubled up your feet for a second? I don't know. Bed tea. I like agency. Harlan, gotta go fast. I'm like Sonic. Mm-hmm. Y'all just getting dentures. That's right. Steps are constantly heard behind double doors. Sure. I'm not worried about that. What? This is where it's supposed to be running? Yeah, I guess so. But I want to see the thing. I'm waiting. Well, that's nothing. We Did we die? No. Why didn't we die? I don't know. Hmm. Is it just going to go booga booga? Barry booga. Jeanette said, oh, then you must have loved Dead Space. No. Um. Light bulb. I didn't mind. I mean, like, Dead Space is fine. I, I just. There's a bunch of tropes that you don't like. You don't like the hiding. Correct. You don't like the. Oh. Um. I don't like overly. Is that three? I don't know what that is. I don't like the. Um... You don't like not being able to press shift to run. Yeah, I don't like overly. Um... You don't oh like a God. small FOV. Yeah, what's the word when they just talk forever? Uh, oh. But like overly dense exposition. And they're like, I found my brother when he was missing when I was 13 years old. The cabin in which we grew up in wasn't going to be there this time, but it was when I went last time. I was wondering if there was... And he's like, you're watching... You like, like environmental storytelling. Much more. And I don't like this. <laughs> I don't know what this is. <laughs> That's okay. So let's, let's try a point and click... Because I do love point and clicks. Like, I like storytelling and I love reading. I know a lot of people think I can't, but... Whoa! That was loud. Behind booties. Presents. Gembrain. Hi, I'm Gembrain. Or abscission? I don't... Is that... Abscission. That's a made-up word, right? Abscess and incision put together, maybe? Abscission? Or abdominals and precision when you have really precise abs? Who 
knows. Uh, this is also apparently very gory, so we'll try this. I love point and clicks, though. I just finished one. KM says, so funny, I always write with a lot of exposition, but then my eyes glaze over when reading it. Can I explain? I can explain, KM. Because I do the same thing at times. You gotta edit. You gotta self-edit. Cut, cut back after you finish writing. I do the same thing. I really I liked what Trin oh, said about editing, which is like set aside your thing for like a couple weeks and then come back. And then come because back and get pissed off and cut it If down. you don't wait long enough, you're reading what you're thinking about and not what's actually on the page. Yeah, for real. But for real, cut, edit, self-edit. Because so much writing is so laborious. Anyway, this Ashfield is Mass, a place like any other. I had lived there. I had lived there my whole life, in that town, crouched by the river. It was a. Actually, this should be a knoll. It was a direct reflection of the humanity that clustered within it, its flaws and its virtues, whilst also presenting as a. Macrocos microcosm, it's not supposed to be macrocosm. Macrocosm, mm. sorry, of the human body. That's me. Hi. You might have wondered how I got here. <laughs> it is Noel. Look at him. That's, what, that's why I knew I saw from the pictures it was like a detective. Everyone's losing their shit. It had the capacity for healthy growth. Somewhere near Massachusetts. Massachusetts. <laughs> two shits. That's what I used to call it. Massachusetts. Because I didn't give two fucking shits about living there, yeah? <laughs> but when it was infected, it could burst. No oh god, no oh god. That's a lot of blurred. See, that's a good intro. Yeah. Not that's not overly exposition. It sets the scene. Riverside, Asfield. <laughs> Thursday, August first. None in anyone. Hashtag no killed Parker. Hashtag. He's and dead. for those of you who don't listen to Malevolent, this is just generic New York detective. So you're, it's a win-win. 10:07 p.m. Oh yeah. This is good. I'm into this. Yeah. The only thing I want. Two. No shits. one is using this elevator tonight. You'll have to take the stairs. Why? I'm sorry, ma'am. As I said before, I can't tell you that. But it's our building. That's the way it is. Can we go? <laughs> Do you want to take the stairs? Hell no. Well, this cop says we can't use the elevator. This guy got a fly around him. That's bullshit. Oh, no, it's the moth. No, it's there. a fly. It's a moth up there. And <laughs> what about Miss Takahara? You wanted to walk up three flights on that hip? I'm sorry, but the elevator can't be used. I don't know how many other fucking words I need to say. Then we'll do a damn bar instead, or whatever. I'm sorry, ma'am. You need to stay for the moment. We may need to ask you some more questions. I don't believe this. Officer Bruce, would you look at that? Will Stanhope. What the hell are you doing here? This ain't a vice case. Hey, Hogan, is this a vice case? Mm. I'm busy, Bruce. Well, it ain't. <laughs> Stanhope can sometimes be presented with different ways of navigating a conversation based on four temperaments? That's interesting. Melancholic, organized, detailed, thoughtful. This approach focuses on the details, allowing Stanhope to get to the heart of the matter. Well, that sounds useful all the time. Mm-hmm. Sympathetic? Empathetic? Empathetic. Pathetic. Phlegmatic? Phlegmatic? I, I've never heard that word. Phlegmatic? I don't think I've ever encountered it. I've never. I've never read that or heard it. Calm, diplomatic, rational. Sometimes a level of sympathy is needed to build trust before the facts are discovered. <laughs> Maramosis Noel's going to punch that old man. <laughs> <laughs> Come over here, you son of a bitch. All oh, red. This is the angry. Accusatory. No, it's going to be a bigger word. It's going to be a $10 word. Mean boy. Choleric. Oh, it's the four humors. Oh. Efficient, confident, demanding. It is a human truth that people lie. And sometimes these lies will be overturned by a strong will. Phlegm is all I can think of when I see phlegmatic. 
sanguine, sociable, optimistic, humorous, fear can stall a witness. A little human connection goes a long way. Cool. There's no single approach <laughs> that works best for all conversations, and Sandhill will need to use all of them in order to be the best he can. This game adapts to your choices. People will remember how he spoke to them and may respond differently in the future, so consider each response carefully. Oh, Cam, is abscission is a real word. Can you define that for me, please? Cool. Yeah. Awesome, but who am I talking to? Depen am I talking to the Ooh. woman? Wait, you're talking to the other officer, right? Well, he asked, he said, this isn't a vice case. And then he called, it's a vice case, which is fine, but who? I don't know who I'm talking to here. Mm. But let's, I mean, you know, let's go with efficient, confident. I don't want to be demanding, but calm, diplomatic, right? Let's go phlegmatic. Easy, I'm not looking to step on anyone's toes. All I know is that Luna called me in. Why would she call you? You'd have to ask her that. Anyway, if I can help, I will. How do I get to the crime scene? Top floor. The only way up is the elevator unless you fancy the fire escape. You, baby. Oh, so he can take the elevator? Lady, I swear to God. Cool. Now, I just want to turn down... Abscission is the natural detachment of parts of a plant, typically dead leaves and ripe fruit. Abscission in trees. Cool. Yeah, Hungry cool. looking man. Oh, yeah, he is. I would find him later if I needed to. First, I need to see Detective Luna upstairs. Officer uh, Steve Bruce was six foot five muscle. We have several run ins over the years, but he was a reliable cop. Cool. I actually didn't pay attention to how he said we get up there. <laughs> uh, you can take the elevator. Is that what he said? Mm -hmm. okay. Whoa. Stanhope's inventory can be accessed here. Yep. I know that. Oh, I've played point clicks before. And let me guess. The last one's his pocket watch. <laughs> his gear satchel. His gears. It's just his gears. <laughs> Stanhope's inventory stores all of his clues and any items he collects. I do like this font. It's kind you of fun. You do? I was yeah. going to say, it's pretty difficult. You're a little bit dyslexic, though. I definitely am. More with numbers. All I mean to say is I played a lot Ooh. of point and clicks and the size of the pixel that they're using matters and they went really chunky mm -hmm. with this one. I missed all this. Some puzzles require Stan Hope to combine clues or items. Make sure you carefully examine all the evidence. Good luck, detective. The like, crystals are like up and down arrows and that like spike. This is so chunky. Yeah. Like this is, I have to almost squint to make it, to read it faster. Luna had called me as I was about to leave the office. She said she needed help with the homicide. I hadn't worked for one for years, but I couldn't say no to her. We had too much history. The apartment block was in Riverside. It was an old factory, red brick and steel. I could smell the tang of blood as I entered the lobby. Perfect. Yeah, the whole chat just kind of went silent. Everyone's really enthralled by this game. Or they've all gone to bed. Good night. <laughs> got blood stain. Yeah, let's stain this blood. There was a considerable amount of blood stained the cloth that covered the floor. Judging from the color and viscosity, it was still relatively fresh. Now let's talk to Officer Braintree. A patrolman I hadn't met before was standing nearby. I noticed he kept glaring at the office. Uh, it's glaring at the stairs. His badge read brain tree. Looks like he needed a cup of coffee. So I guess she's upstairs, probably. I no above. Yeah. Let's take a look around first. Leather jacket. Got a small black book filled with addresses and phone numbers. I decided it could be useful. There was nothing I needed from the bookshelf table. There was nothing I needed to grab. Easel. Interesting. Broken glass. I wasn't going to run my hands through broken glass, but there was one shot that appeared larger than the others and glistened with blood. Let's mm -hmm. take a look at that. Looks like someone... Was that a handprint, you think? One piece of glass was stained with blood as though it has been used. Yeah, as it looks like a handprint. I slipped on a glove and carefully bagged the glass for future analysis. That is... Handprint. A bloody handprint. Rather large. Could this be the perps? So it looks like someone took off the leather jacket. Maybe they were being painted for a portrait. Oh, this is a big drop sheet. Right? It could be for painting. Broken vent. That's important. Someone broke in. Blood dripped from the broken vent. The metal was buckled and torn. What could have done this? Collection of paintings. 
fallen canvas. That's the canvas that fell over. So maybe someone was painting and came in from behind them and killed them. Alright, let's go upstairs. Where's the body? Oh, boy. Okay. Good lord. Her name was Serena Challoner. <laughs> I've never seen anything like it. Are you sure? What do you mean, Luna? What is this? Look at her, Stanhope. Look at her. The woman, or what was left of her, was tied to the wall. The jaw was distended, most probably broken. Her skin was a patchwork of blood bruises, ribs pushed through ragged flesh. She appeared to have... Oops. She appeared to have been hollowed out with very little besides bone and gristle left inside the sagging remains of a torso. Yeah, no, it don't ring a bell. You said look at her. Detective Amelia, blah, blah, blah. Have you been here long? About 20 minutes. I was surprised you called me. Honestly, so was I. But I hope you can see why. Just look at the poor woman. But the, there are other detectives. Isn't Jim Lewis your partner? He's on leave. But even if he wasn't, I think you're a better fit. What about Arthur Lester? He's my friend from Arkham. Nah, Whatever. fuck that guy. Look, do you need my expertise with evidence gathering? Just look at her, Will. Doesn't this remind you of anything? Lascato prosthetics? The disappearance of Cassandra Burgess. There was a twitch in her eye between the lid and the orbital floor. There was a tiny window to the nerves beneath. I see. I need to get my head around this scene. I understand. Can you look for some leads while I'm up here? Anything get us started. Will do. It's been a long time. Two years. Not the way I'd hoped to meet. <clears throat> I found a piece of glass. It looks like it might have been used as the murder weapon. I'll get it to the doctor. Uh, let me have a look around. Cool. This seems like a game that you would write. Yeah. I was curious, parched... It was a curious, parched landscape. The earth had an odd texture, remarkable, opalescent. The brushwork was almost photorealistic. I personally preferred my art a little more abstract, but I could see the appeal. The window broken? Outside, life in Asheville continued to crawl along, oblivious to the carnage within the apartment. Music's really good. Yeah, it is. Antique vase. Perhaps it was a family heirloom. Can you move, please? What's under the carpet? I love that she's smoking. Yeah. Uh, nothing. nothing. I would like to look at the corpse closer. Yeah, there we go. Oh, can I get over there? <clears throat> okay. Let's look at the address book. Oops. Containing names and phone numbers, if I wanted to look up a contact of Serena's, this was the best way. I just needed a first name. Okay. My handgun and wallet. I'll talk to him. I mean, this vent... Queen says, Noel needs his own everything. I want the Noel podcast at this point. And Deal. Lambda says, no, but for real. For real, a murder mystery noir detective podcast with Noel? That would go hard. Who said I haven't done it yet? Who said it's not already? Who said it's not in, in the, works? the works? Just, I got so many big ideas. Don't you worry. You think he's being facetious, but he's not. Spain. <laughs> About this case. So what do we know so far? Victor's name is Serena Challenger. Hogan is getting some more details from the landlord. He was bobbling, babbling when I got here. I can see why. Do you have any suspects? Not yet. Do you think this is linked to the Lascado case? So the same way the others died. Whoa. The body has been emptied. You can tell me that's typical modus operandi. Of course not, but look at these ropes. I don't even know what they're made of. Whoa. 
cool. So the Scott Alt had a fire after. The Scott Alt case was horrific, and I don't blame you for responding to the emotionally charged media fervor. Well, you're a good man, but you need to learn more about people. Let's discuss something else. Amelia. It's been a long time. Sure. Two years. Oh, we did this already. Mm -hmm. uh, we should catch up. Okay. I found a piece of glass. We already said that, but what did she say? I'll give it to Dr. Abdulov. Maybe we need to leave? Or maybe give it to one of the forensics dudes? Yeah. Is that him, maybe? Let's Can see. we use the glass on him? Let's see. pants off up here too which is interesting deep in conversation about the crime scene they were obviously uneasiness in their eyes from the amount of blood I couldn't blame them we can't talk oh can't talk to this guy now officer you must be detective Stanhope nice very stood well was it the coat also the fact that they let you in I'm officer Dan Blaine Twee <laughs> <laughs> Haven't seen a crime like this. Haven't seen it ever. Just wait until you see upstairs. Already seen it. I guess I forget that the uh, two clicks. You look tired. Been up since five this morning. Where is Detective Luna? We already know that, but let's just exhaust it. What do you know about the crime scene? The most, I suppose. I was the first responder. According to the landlord, the Vic's name is Serena Challenger. She's upstairs. I thought it was just a domestic. Anything else I need to know? Prepare yourself. Goodbye. Okay. Collection of paintings. Can we talk to the landlord? Yeah, I guess we can go back downstairs now. Ah. Nervous looking man, Officer Bruce. Ice cream stain. <gasps> Mm. <laughs> Tell me you don't want an ice cream sandwich. Of course I do. Uh, sorry, sorry. May I ask you a few questions? I spoke to the other guy, the cop over there. He said, I'm not in trouble. Am I in trouble? No, sir. We just need to get a clear picture. What's your name? It's Carl. Carl Laidlaw. I told the other guy. Relax. It's just to be polite. I'd like to know who I'm talking to. You the landlord? Uh-huh. The janitor, handyman, you name so it. So slumlord, then. <laughs> Let's discuss what happened. Can you start with telling me your involvement? I wasn't involved. I just... I just found her. I called it in. 9.30, I think. I don't know. The other cops said it was the time. I didn't look. So start from the beginning. You went up to her apartment. You had a key... I got keys to all the apartments. It's my building, Serena. I mean, Miss Challenger doesn't... Didn't have a door as such. Well, with her having the whole top floor. See, this used to be an old clothes factory. You need to unlock the button to the top floor. Okay. Well, yeah, let's go... S detailed. Is it usual for you to visit your tenants so late? I don't know. I mean, I hadn't seen her for a few days. I see. Was there anything in particular that made you visit so late? I had stuff to do. A leaky faucet, a broken light. Why? I'm just trying to put a picture together. Every detail is important. Please talk me through what happened from when you opened the lift door. I saw the blood. I mean, you've been there. It's everywhere. I just stood there for a while, too scared to move. Then I called out to see if Miss Collender was okay. There was no answer, so I searched the place. I was careful not to touch the blood, of course. When I got to the bedroom, I saw... I saw... Yeah... I don't fucking know what I saw. You've been up there. What the fuck are those rope things? Who could have ripped her apart like that? I ran out as fast as I could and called the cops. Hmm. I mean, why would he go up to his apartment at 9.30? It seems odd. It does seem weird. Right? Um, I agree with chat. Landlords are pieces of shit. Yep. How long have you known Mrs. Chalinor? Since January, I think she moved here from down south somewhere. Since you wanted a fresh start, she ain't local. 
She went on the top floor. She said she wanted somewhere with enough space to get her paintings done. How would you describe her personality? I don't know, buddy. She was quiet, you know. Always paid on time, was polite enough towards the end. She sort of changed. In what way? Was she depressed? If anything, was the opposite. She just smiled all the time. Maybe she was on drugs. Wow. Went around with some shady characters. Like who? People came by. Guys, I didn't ask their names. Hmm. Was she involved in anything dangerous? Maybe she wore black clothes all the time, listened to loud rock and roll music. She sounds awesome. Wearing black clothes is hardly dangerous. Boy, I'm going Arthur, fuck. I know that, but you know <laughs> these kids today get drunk all the time. They get into drugs. It's 1991 after all. Looking at her apartment, she seems to be an artist. Yeah, she was, and a good one, I suppose. Not just an artist, she helped run a gallery, too. Oh, there's our next point of interest. Mm -hmm. A gallery, do you remember the name of it? Star something, Starlit Gallery, I think. It's over in Neptune. Her and some other girl ran it, but I never met her. Clue gained, I was going to say. Solid lead. Anything else? Cool. That's it. Yes. Let's go talk to Luna. Crotch ice cream. I do like the look of the ice cream dripping out of the back pockets, though. Back pockets? Of the ice cream pants? Oh, uh, what ice cream pants? You just said that. What? You just said ice cream pants. Did I? Yeah. What pocket dripping out, though? This picture someone posted. I didn't see it. Did I was just saying it. Wait, why? I don't know. Tired? <laughs> you. Sometimes I say things, okay? Apropos Sometimes of I just nothing. Think my thoughts. <laughs> I'm gonna have to watch this back to make sure I'm not gaslighting myself. I don't remember, did I? <laughs> There's no way of knowing. Ice cream pants. Oh, he's very grumpy. Oh, let's Gabriel go. said he did say it. Phew. Yeah, I probably. Okay, good. I wasn't saying I didn't. I just don't remember saying it. Joe, he said ice cream crotch. Yeah, 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 yeah. Crotch ice cream out of the blue. I'm crying. <laughs> okay, so there are more leads to find. Interesting. I would love to know more about the victims. Uh, suitors. I mean, assuming they're suitors. But he said he didn't know any of their names. Yeah, I mean, he saw some guys. Oh, you know what would be interesting? Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use the... Address book? Address book. Hey, okay. nice. Nope. Nope. Okay. What if you show him some bloody glass? <laughs> hey, hey, man, look at this. Hmm. Or like the jean jacket or the, the leather jacket. Yeah, but I can't... Can't pick it up. Pick it. Uh, I don't think so. Let's see. I had already added the address book. There was nothing else in the pockets. Yeah. Hmm. Let's check out this table. Yeah. There's no need to grab it. There were yeah. pots, paints, brushes, and palettes. Green paint had spilled and dripped on the floor, staining the planks. Ice cream. That's right. There was no need to grab it. Yeah, you want ice cream? Just an ice cream sandwich. I want an ice cream sandwich or ice cream cone. You want an ice cream cone? What if we ordered Dairy Queen? What if we did? It's not like we're having an entire ice cream cake tomorrow. Shh, 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 shh. You say that like w like you and I will eat the whole thing. Yes. <laughs> Most of the books were on the works of artists using very different techniques. Warhol sat next to Vallejo, for example, but there was some... Oops. It was more like the lifetimes of accumulation. This is nothing I needed. This vent... Can I not go closer? What's there? A collection of paintings. Broken glass. Blood stain. Can't talk to them. Did talk to him. There's this vase. I can't imagine what it is good for. Dresser. 
corpse. Is there something specifically on the corpse we can touch? Maybe a piece of this rope? else here? It's been a long time. What have you found so far? Should we catch up? Ah, that's it. What? I found out where Serena worked. We did. Oh. And she said, uh, can you follow up? And I said, consider it done. And then I tried to leave. And it said I still have more leads to find. I'm missing something. Can I just look at the book myself? I miss what these are. These just scroll up and down? Yeah. Okay. If I want to look up a contact, this is the best way. I just need a first name. Okay. So we just need a first name. What would a name be? I mean, most likely downstairs, right? I mean, if there's the no elevator. other way, there's no other room for us. That's what they say. <sighs> he won't talk to us. He's got nothing to say. The ice cream stain. I just ordered us ice cream. You did not. <laughs> did you really? Yeah. Both of us? Yeah. What'd you get me? I got you a blizzard. That's pretty fun. Yeah. What flavor. Oreo with the royal thing oh, in the middle. That's so fucking exciting. <laughs> oh, that's fun. I didn't even ask you because I wanted it to be a secret Thanks, surprise. Um, can you follow the footprints like down to the bottom of the I don't screen? I think so. Let's see. Usually there's like a carryover, like yeah, going yeah. somewhere type thing. Let's just check this again, make sure that I didn't misunderstand this. See, Cheryl, the peanut there butter parfait. To be found here. I need more leads. Okay. Peanut butter parfait is Harlan's favorite, but you can't order it with Uber Eats for some reason. So, okay. So we've asked them all this. How long? How would you describe her personality? The royal she middle is like a chocolate. Th Thing. It's like chocolate sauce that goes in the middle, I guess. Oh, hold on. Wait. Oh, yeah, no, this is the same thing. The solid lead location. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, the only other thing I can think of is the pocketbook. Hmm. He said that we wanted to put the... Right. Piece of glass. Oh wait, did we give her? We didn't give her the fucking pocketbook. Oh, is so that stupid? That's why. Mm. Hold on. Oops. No. Okay. Does does she need any of the evidence? Well, this was supposed to go to the doctor or some shit. Okay. Are we missing picking something up? The pants or I don't know. Wallet. So sometimes if you press like control or something, no. Okay. In this room we got the vase, the dresser, the three people, the painting, her, and the window. That's all we can interact with, correct? And we've interacted with everything. Seems like it. And here we have the vent. This guy, the jacket, bookcase, the broken glass, the handprint. Table, the friends I team, the easel, the canvas, the blood stain. The vent. Yeah, and the collection of paintings. I... 
polite menace says was there something in the jacket pocket i'm only recently on yes there was a um address book that's where we got the address book there's a moth up there that was the key <laughs> can't show him the pocketbook uh Unless I miss something about these things. Oh, what's that? That's how you use something. Or how you combine something, maybe? I don't remember. Uh, cold 1911. Oh, maybe how you examine it? That's examine. That's use. I see. Cool. Very creepy. Okay, cool. So... We just this guy. I feel like this is the most logical thing. We've he exhausted everything. Doesn't want to talk about it. Was it because we chose a more passive approach? No, we wouldn't lock ourselves out, would we? Can you no. just fail a point and click adventure game like that? No. I mean not good ones. Yeah, that's all the same. I'm I'm wondering if it's bugged. Yeah? N I mean, no. My my instinct is no because games like this, ah, bloody bootprint. Okay. Okay. Did we get everything now? Can we leave? I mean, it didn't say clue gained, but let's talk to her. Why the vent? That's interesting. So I wonder if she had someone here. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And then he left. What's that blue thing on the carpet? That's the ice cream. Oh, right. The whole reason that we're ordering ice cream. <laughs> so it definitely seems like he had a, or she had a gentleman suitor or a suitor. Yeah. Right? You think there was sexy time happening? I don't know. He could have been an artist or like whatever. But look, someone came to the elevator, yes. went down, and left. But something also came through the vent. And there was also a fight here. I think something left through the vent. Also, what broke? Like a little monster left. Oh, Maybe. Polite Menace's cat's watching the stream. Hi, Remember Katie. that? Um, photo someone took of their cat watching you run Call of Cthulhu and they were sitting on a tiny cat sized couch watching you no I love that picture oh yes I do yeah that was cute <laughs> a forest though underwater can I not talk to these no Scotty did the Among Us meeting button is that pertaining to a clue that you know of? Guys? Anyone? Bueller? I'm not that bad at point and clicks. You're very good at point and clicks. Yeah. This one... Missing something. Oh, maybe the spike was to get a hint. I think. Can you combine items? I can normally, but... Combine your gun with your wallet and make a wallet gun. <laughs> shoot the evidence. <laughs> shoot, the, shoot the glass? Hmm... What's the game called again? Are we at the point where we want people to look up walkthroughs? I'm at the point where I'm going to look up something, I think. Um. Uh, I'm just going to pause it. Oops. 
Yeah, shoot the evidence. Is there more clothing in the bottom right corner? I don't think we could click on it is the problem. Oh, this is the same problem I had with something else. I like how the items sometimes give a little shaky shake. Yeah, it's fun. Should we call the stream when our ice cream gets here or should we just oh, 100%. nibble? No, you know me. Okay. Well, we have 12 minutes. Oh, boy. <laughs> What's this game called? The game is called... Oh, now they're both watching it. <laughs> it's really cute. Okay, I'm just going to check real quick. Just going to see if someone was like... Because I think this might be a newer game. There. Solved. Stuck at the beginning. Where? Two down from there. Yep. Nope. No, that's Mark's flat. It's way after. Go to walk through. Head up through the elevator. Inspect the bloody footprints. Inspect the easel. Pick up the bloody piece of glass. Use the black leather jacket. Acquire the notebook. Talk to the officer Braintree. Head up the stairs. Talk to the detective. Talk to the landlord. Oh, ask, ask about, about the, the boot, boot print. prints. Oh. We got it. We got it. Okay. All right. We won't fail again, everyone. Sorry, everybody. That was the first and only hint that we're going to do. Go back. Let's discuss what happened tonight, maybe. Ah. No, I was just oh, saying, yeah, yeah. Keep getting. What about what happened tonight? Can, maybe can we use stuff in the environment? Hi, Danny. Hi, Danny. What do you what did you eat tonight? Danny says that they're so full of food. How do we talk to the landlord about the boot print? Hmm. Uh, how have you known her? How long have you known her? How would you describe her personality? Was she involved? Seems to be an artist. Get the other thing. Let's get the alley. Something seems fucking. What's your name, sir? Can we go back to like yeah, the maybe? very beginning? Ugh. Let's discuss what happened. Is there another boot print that we're missing? Maybe there's one in maybe 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 one in the room. Yeah, sure. Ah, there we go. Prints. Couldn't pick it up. That's fine. Excellent. Oh, okay. That's what we needed. Ooh. That's pretty fucking small to see. Okay, are you ready to hear what Danny had? Yeah, Danny. Danny ate so much. Salad, a chicken, incredible, well-made with great mashed potatoes, all caps, mm. and mm. flan with ice cream. Nope, mm. sorry, flan with cream. We found a set of boot prints in her apartment. Do you have any idea who they may belong to? I don't know. She had a few visitors, but I can't really remember any of them. She did have a boyfriend a couple of months back. Same young punk with green hair and metal in his face. I think he wore some big leather boots. Remember his name? She called him Maki, so Mark something. I don't know. Perfect. Okay. Let's look up. Mark. Mark. I guess we combine these. There was only one Mark in the pocketbook. Mark Torrance. I need to look him up in the database. All right, we'll let Luna know. Phew. We did it. Guys, we did it. Hey. I'm so proud of us. To be fair, those footprints are hard to find. Oops. Uh, yeah. Oops. Yes. Cool. Should we call it there? How how long till ice cream? 
We got seven minutes left. I can't wait to watch Star Trek and eat ice cream. Me? Neither. The night was unexpectedly calm. The air was thick soup clinging to my bones. I fell asleep on my easy chair. The town seemed to be holding its breath. If I dreamed, I couldn't remember it. But that was nothing new. Dawn sunlight was bleached bone. It was around the time I was drinking my second cup of coffee that I realized I'd missed Abigail's birthday again. She probably hadn't noticed. Sunlight was bleached bone. It's I nice love word, that. Right? Yeah, it's really well. I like that. Well written. It's it's frilly without being mm -hmm. gaudy. You know what I mean? Like it's nice. I had never been much of a father, but she had never really needed me, even when the mother passed away. Maybe I'd ring her later. But first, it was time to visit the morgue. Dr. Abdulov had been burning the midnight oil. I think it's the brevity. Sunlight is bone, you know? Yeah. Thank you for completing the autopsy so promptly, Dr. Abdulov. I appreciate you working through the night. No skin off my nose. I couldn't sleep. My daughter had a puppy for her birthday, and the poor thing seems to be scared of the dark. Cries all through the night. It's like having another child. And Please call me Tamir. I know uh, we're at work, but no one else here, so why so formal? If a person earns a doctorate, it should be respected in my view. Ha! Please tell my wife that next time you're over for dinner. <laughs> now, shall we get started? Certainly. You have a time of death? It's a difficult question to answer. Looking at the relative lack of cloudiness within the corneas, I would place the time of death between 8 and 9 p.m. yesterday. That fits with the statement from uh, the landlord. But the liver... Mortis, the levality of the blood and the pools in the skin places it two or three days ago. Uh, then there's the soft tissue both attached to the corpse and separate. There are aspects of necrosis that could place the time of death a week ago. Well, how is that possible? Honestly, I'm not sure. Hmm. What was the cause of death? Well, from the scattering of the organs, you would assume a swift death due to blood loss. At least that was my worst first assessment, but the timings don't match. What do you mean? The lungs are relatively fresh. I mean, I, I wouldn't want to put them on my pizza. <laughs> uh, yes, well, I, I mean to say that judging from the lack of necrosis, uh, they largely match the time of death measured through the corneal cloudness. The liver, however, is a very poor state. Tissues degrading and ne necrotizing at alarming rates. Similarly, same of the skin around her stomach. Also carries the same, well, sponginess, for lack of a better word. Perhaps it could be caused by some kind of acid. Maybe if she was submerged in a bath of a corrosive agent. But no, the skin of her legs, while showing lividity, is relatively well preserved. It's as if parts of her body were long dead while she was still alive. Honestly, it's a little disconcerting. A little. Perhaps it would affect me more if I had some sleep. <laughs> Everything seems a little vague. Have you analyzed the glass shard? Uh, was it the murder weapon? I can't say for sure. Looking at the chest cavity, the stomach, the skin does seem to be cut. It's more like a series of tears. To be honest, the skin in such a bad condition, it could have probably been pulled apart by someone's hands. Unbelievable. And yet, true. With regards to the glass, the majority of the blood matches the blood type of the victim. However, there was another type I've sent a sample to the database. Thank you. Uh, what about the rope that was found at the scene? Ah, uh, of course. I have a small section of it here. Uh, it's on ice. You'll see why. What the hell am I looking at? I wish I knew. I have sent a piece for DNA analysis. It will take a day or two. It's organic matter. Fleshy, yet run through with fibers, rather like cooked celery. It's as if a vine were crossed with a digestive tract. It is a rather tough exterior, but the insides are almost liquid. I am aware of how it sounds. Please inspect it and tell me what you think. Uh, like I'm no doctor. I hardly think that matters with this substance. This appears torn. I tried to cut it with a scalpel, but there are strong strands of stuff, probably. It appears soft on the surface, sometimes. It shivers on occasion. A ripple that tenses the surface, a spasm of sorts. It's moving. Yes, the fascinating thing is... If I use a pin to agitate it... Oh my god. Good lord. Strands. These strands, are they growing? Apparently so. 
I'll be freezing this section soon, <laughs> believe me. I don't know where to make any of this. Why are you even taking the case? Your vice. Luna asked me. I have the time. Do you? I'll make the time. If you say so. I'm going to make... Going to the office. Can One you minute till ice point? cream time. Perfect. Of course. Uh, it'll be done within the hour. Before you go, there's just one more thing. It might be nothing, but it struck me as a little curious. The victim has a tattoo. Uh, it's a diamond. Bright red on the inside of a left wrist. Thank you, Dr. Timmer. Thank you, Timmer. Anything else you let me know? Will? Yeah. Look after yourself. Will do. I'll be in touch. Cool. Well, we're going to leave it here. Good um, game how's so far. This? Are I mean, chat. Keep everyone's streaming? loving this game. Yeah. Yeah. Detective Stan Hope, it's Brain Tree. Sorry, sir, but I love her delivered to you by hand this morning. I left it by your computer. Should have left it with the other desk with the lamp. I'm sure I'll find it. Is there anything else? I have a message from Officer Bruce. He said to say that he apologized for the way he spoke to you. Well, it's good to know. Thanks, Brain Tree. My pleasure. I realized it was raining odd for this time of the year. The rope. What the hell could it be? Cool. Yeah, I'll save it. Poop one. Poop one. All right. Ladies, gentlemen, non-binary friends. Uh, let us know if you enjoyed this, if we want to play it again. I love point-and-click adventure games. This game came out, to my knowledge... October 26, 2023. So Pretty six new. months ago. Yeah. It's positive rating. It's only got 41 ratings. The thing I find is that a lot of point and click adventure games don't get much love, uh, which is why I tend to play them. So check them out. But that is it from us. I hope you had a wonderful time. Join us on Thursday. That's a week from yesterday to watch Army of Darkness. Oh, yeah. We're going to do another movie night. Last Unicorn was so much fun yesterday. I had a blast. We're going to hang out, watch one of my fave movies of yeah. all time. If you haven't seen Army of Darkness, oh, my God. It's going to um, be fun. But, yeah, that's it for us tonight. We're going to go have some ice cream. Have a wonderful, wonderful night and a wonderful weekend. Thanks and for hanging out. And as always... We will see you around the table. Good night, everyone. Good night.